people are really forgetting how truly dominant Zion really was his rookie year. In 2019, he was putting up some numbers like 24, 7, and 3 as a rookie. People haven't seen that type of rookie since Shaquille O'Neal. And people really want to say he isn't worth it and he's a bust. Maybe, yeah, maybe he's injury prone. But once he comes back from his injury, what do you think is going to happen? Okay, he might gain a couple pounds. But he's still going to give you a solid 22, 7, and 4 every night. So stop playing with him. I mean, what other rookie is stealing a ball from one of the strongest NBA players of, of all time, really, to be honest? A.K.A. Giannis. What what other rookie or even just player in general has ever done this to somebody that strong and just ripped it out of them? Summer league and preseason where <laughs> oh yeah. my gosh. <laughs> Williamson just vice grips the basketball and takes it away. Brooke Lopez just looked like me if I ever saw my dad. The reason why I'm making this video is really to, just to shine the light on why these trade talks are just stupid. Number one, like, yeah, he's gotten into some trouble, but at least he's not popping guns and trying to be a fake thug like John Morant. Two, the trade talks don't even make sense. Why would they trade an, uh, this year's number four pick for Zion? Zion is worth more than what Wimby is. Wimby is going to be a bust. When, when Wimby's a bust, come back to this video and PayPal me or cash at me because, like, y'all going to be in the comments I already know what I'm saying. Us, bro, just trust me. He's he's not big enough. He he can't make a he can't make a midi. He can't make a three. He's just taller than everyone else in the overseas, and that's why he's good. And it's not gonna be like that in the NBA. I'm sorry, buddy, but yeah. And number three, just look at what Zion's already done. He's already an All Star. He's gonna be a, another All Star candidate. And he just he just my glory is king at the end. That'd be crazy, man. Oh, how many bodies do you got? How many bodies I got, y'all? <laughs> hey, all I gotta say is this this room. I'm gonna say between three of us, we probably at least got over like 70, 80. No, I'm saying over like 200. Let's put that out there. 